Okay. 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 Ok
A lot of y'all didn't want to give me the tea, but some of y'all came through with some awesome stuff. I'm so I know y'all fucking. Girl. Girl. <sighs> Come on, Cheers, guys. you fucking drama bitch. queen. <laughs> Demonetized like <laughs> all across the board. <laughs> literally, almost sorry. Spit all of sorry, mom. <laughs> That's okay. Spit it out, girl. Get it out. Mm. You want to try mine? Is it really sweet? Mm. I mean, holy fuck, that Ew. strong. <laughs> it is so. Shit it. Yeah, and we'll have to make another margarita later, for sure. Okay, I love this thing. Yeah, that is pretty awesome. You can have it. Thanks. Yeah, of course. Okay. You sure? Yeah, what the fuck? It's only eight bucks. I'm done that. <laughs> Let's get started. So, we are gonna get started on cooking. Like I said, she's gonna make the jalapeno poppers <laughs> and explain everything. And then I'm gonna make, get started on the taco casserole. So I've got all our ingredients prepped right here, which is called a musum plow. Mise en place. Mise en place. Tell, uh, boop, tell us about you. G this girl went to culinary school. She knows all the tea on food. Yes. Yeah. She is. She's I'll awesome. fuck you up in the kitchen. <laughs> I'm literally going to have to censor so much. You're so aggressive too with the F bombs. Like, oh, I know. <laughs> um, but she will. I was asking her today how to make ravioli. She's like, yeah, I totally know how to make this and this and this and this. Mm -hmm. I was like, girl. I want to get a yes. pasta thing. Yeah. Yeah, so, so we, we can should. make pasta together on yes. our channel. So. Okay, so I'm gonna turn on my um, Chase just burner. Doing it. Yeah. So explain. We're gonna do some just like regular jalapeno poppers, and then She's, with okay. the vegan cream cheese, I do jelly. She said she puts grape, grape jelly in her jalapeno poppers. I was like, I have grape jelly. Let's try it. And then normally with the grape jelly. I um, mix it together and then I put a slice of apple on it and I wrap it in bacon. you crazy. All right, so I'm just heating this up and I'm gonna saute some onions and garlic and then the rest of these um, veggies. Is this is this, this, like is, this is vegan chorizo. You never had it, have you? It's no. bomb. It is so good. Okay, not I know you'll really like it. But you don't have to be vegan to eat vegan food. That's very true. But I've actually really never had vegan food. You you gonna learn this, today? You can see my finger swipe. I tried it today and it's so freaking good. It has like a hint of cashew, but it's literally tastes like cream cheese. Yeah, it is. It's bomb. Yeah, I called my boyfriend and we we met in culinary school and he this he's kind chef. of against Hi. vegans because he chef life. But that's that, that's. That's interesting. Yeah. Like it's that's not, that should be an opportunity to create more dishes and to expand your knowledge. You know I mean, what I mean? Yeah, but you can always, you know, yeah, use animal products, but like also <clears throat> learning about veganism could be a cool entity of your culinary schools. Mm -hmm. You know, school you know in Austin, So what were you saying? I'm sorry. What was I saying? You said in Austin there's a In Austin there's actually a vegan culinary school. There is? Mm hmm I didn't know that. Mm, it's like a small little vegan culinary school. I, I know that there's a bunch of vegan cooking classes, but why do you need to go there when you can watch Madison Mukong? <laughs> For too? real! Uh, subscribe. Okay. Like and subscribe. Comment down below. <laughs> yeah. So you know the real YouTube shade. Okay, okay. so first I'm gonna do just regular and then I'm gonna mix the jelly in. Okay. Okay, so the Kite Hill cream cheese, and then this is the benevolent bacon. It's one of the only vegan bacons that I like. I'm not a fan of vegan bacon, no. I actually hate real bacon. Good job. Thanks. People make fun of me, but I literally hate bacon, and then I get a lot of shit for it. I I will never give you shit for not Thank bacon. you. Love so you, bitch. Do you want a spoon? There's one over there if you need one. No. Okay. Oh, I've if been dying to use her famous spoon. <laughs> and I'm using her famous chili bowl. Oh my god, you are so funny. <laughs> this is a good time to tell the story oh, about how we Okay, you tell okay. them. So, um, I was going through a really hard time. You tell them. Anyways, I was going through. <laughs> yeah. No, I was going through a really hard time. My boyfriend was like cheating on me at the time, blah, blah. All my friends left me in Austin and I was just alone. Like I was mm -hmm. always with people. And then like, I moved in with this guy from culinary school 
and they just moved back to Houston and all I had was FaceTime. That's literally probably why I FaceTime you like seven yeah, times Yeah, we FaceTime all the time. It's kind of annoying. <laughs> And I was just like going through a really hard time and I was like watching her videos like all I had was YouTube I was just alone. I was drinking and Yeah, so I saw that in one of her videos. She was like talking about she was from Austin And once she said she was from fucking Austin Bitch I fucking commented on her video and I was like, we need to hang out. I'm going through a hard time. I need a girlfriend. Us girls need to stick together. And she was like, fuck yes. No, you messaged me on Instagram. Did I? That's how I found out. Well, that's how I, I first started remember. talking. <laughs> I was drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my life. <laughs> no. Yeah, and then we just like started like just FaceTiming Chilling for a little bit. Yeah. And then one day I just had a, like a really shitty night. And she just pulled up and picked me up and we had we had a wonderful evening. Yes. <laughs> it was fun, yeah, we had a good time. Yeah, but like she um she had messaged me, by the way, I'm sauteing onions, garlic, bell pepper, and a lot of oil because we're gonna be adding vegan proteins which don't have a fat in them, a lot of fat in them, so you need a lot of oil. So for the beef today, we're gonna be using the Gardein beefless beef crumbles. I'm gonna use about half of this package. Um, which I've never sure. had. Oh yeah, the, the, these are good. These are good, good, good. Oh, my burner keeps turning off. Sorry. Oh my God. When you had that sale on your Instagram. Do you want to smell it? Sale? What sale? Your whole, you were like, you were like, oh, there's like a huge sale with like this. Oh brand. my gosh. And yeah, your whole Instagram fucking story. grocery cart was like just meat. <laughs> it's just guardian. Guardian, yeah. sponsor me the like, house. What's like, she's going so hard. Yeah. <laughs> Totally. So I just put in about half of the package of the Gardein Beefless Beef Crumbles. I I don't know, like I just put things in in random stages. Like all this is gonna go in, but in different bits. Um, and I have reasoning behind it. Did we put um, the garlic? I put garlic in there. Oh, okay. oh, I put garlic in there. I was like, <laughs> you better get that garlic in there, girl. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, I, you can't really see the pan, but all of the oil really soaked into the Gardein Beefless Beef Crumbles. You don't have to use that much oil, but... You know, I love whatever. Yeah. So, anyways, she messaged me, and, um, yeah, you were just really chill. It was right around the time I had my surgery, and, you know, like, I was, like, in bed for an entire week. And so, mm -hmm. we talked a lot, yeah. Um, and, yeah, you were chill. Dude, she cracks me up. Like, honestly, she's so funny. Oh, I have, I forgot to move the, the thing. She keeps looking down at the viewfinder I down know. here. Are, have you, you been looking, move it. have you been looking <laughs> at it? No, I've been, I okay. think. Good, I'm proud of you. Sorry guys, I'm, I'm completing down. <laughs> because I have like this screen right here where you can see yourself on, on my laptop. And um, <laughs> she, she wants me to start a YouTube it. channel Look at their so bad. And oh. I'm so nervous. You guys, I do want her to you to start a YouTube channel. This is soy I have a chorizo. Lot to say. This is soy chorizo that I'm putting in the pan right here. She does, and she goes on these tirades, dude. And like, <laughs> I, I, they're so funny because she's going off about <laughs> nothing, nothing. <laughs> literally yeah. nothing. And she changes the subject like 12 times while she's talking. I'm like, Morgan, what the? <laughs> Like, where yeah. are we going with this? I'll call her about something and then we end up in like 15 different conversations and then after those 15 different conversations, I go back to that conversation. Yeah, I literally like, went anyways, out of my way to I cannot, I cannot. And then I like, at, some, at a certain point, I'm just like, I, 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 I'm like, I really have to like check in. I'm like, Morgan, are you're you sitting okay? on your bathroom floor next to your toilet ranting about nothing. <laughs> like what, what is, what is life? <laughs> No, it's, it's, but it's bad. No, it's a good time. We all need friends that we can just keep. All my friends tell with. me that I need to start a YouTube channel you know, because I always have something to say. We talked about this. We need to get you a YouTube channel. I know. Okay, you guys, here's. The and thing. I'm a huge YouTube watcher. Oh my God. Well, same. It's bad. Um, well, you know it too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Literally, okay. when I was like prepping all this, we were. Watching, watching YouTube, YouTube in the yeah. background. Like not listening to music, but okay. it's just like so casual. I finished doing the plain jalapenos. Oh shit. And now I'm gonna do what is the it? The one with the grape jelly? Yeah. What is it I'm so excited Hi to try this. Cream cheese. Cream cheese with 
Grape jelly. Grape jelly. Grape jelly is where it's I think at. I love it before. I'm excited. Like, she said it was like sweet and spicy. So good. So I'm adding carrots into mine now. The, here's here's where I'm at, you guys. I add my my vegetables into stages in, in terms of like how much I like them cooked. Like I like n not very cooked mushrooms. So that's why I'm putting them in last. But everything else I like to. Oh, you soft. always put in mushrooms last. Oh, is that a thing? Yeah. Oh, I didn't. I didn't know that. Like they're gonna be overcooked. It's like putting in yes. fritz. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I thought it was just a me thing. No. Because I didn't go to like no culinary school. I'm not fancy. Okay. <laughs> okay. So mushrooms are gonna go in last. We'll put in our corn now. She's mixing up the grape jelly and the cream cheese. Look at those. Show the show them. Yeah. And you might have you to wait it? until it focuses. Like if you oh. hide out our faces. She's learning how to YouTube, you guys. I'm learning. <laughs> I'm doing my best. It's so good. You and normally after this, I put an apple slice on the top and then I wrap it in bacon. But screw that. Okay. <laughs> so I put in the corn. We're gonna put in the mushrooms last. Right here, y'all. This <clears throat> is Sprouts taco seasoning. Usually I would just put mm. in a blend of my own seasoning. It smells but so good. She bought mm -hmm. it in a bag and I was like, I literally, I was like, what is this? And he goes, taco seasoning. Yeah, it was, it's so good. God. Okay. Oh, cheers. Let me, let me have a drink with you. No. I literally <laughs> forgot no, about this. I was like so into <laughs> this. So I just mixed um, like two or three tablespoons of the taco seasoning with some water and it kind of made like a, a runny paste and um, I do that just because I want to be able to spread it all over the pan. You're um, actually really good at cooking. Thanks. Oh my god that means no, a lot. You really are. are. Somebody who, who was trained. That like blows my mind. I just not to be a like, lot. You know like you're actually like you know your shit. Yeah, well, it's. I mean, for me, it's just trial and error. You know, I've, 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 I've fucked up a lot of things. Girl, you trust me. <laughs> me? I, I mean, I fuck up at home sometimes. Oh, same, same. Sometimes I cook something and I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Ew. You're like, I spent three hours on this. <laughs> yeah, and you're like trash. This is bad. No, one time I, I made chili for the first time and I was like going off of a recipe, and it said put in cinnamon. And I put in way too much cinnamon, and yep. I, I tossed the whole thing out. Uh, that's I was like, a bummer, because you always make a ton of Awful. No, it was like huge. Yeah. Yeah. And it honestly was embarrassing. The first time I um, fried chicken at home, Everyone my boyfriend and I were really hungover one day. I don't want to use his name. Oh, fuck. Um, <laughs> and y'all think I curse a lot. <laughs> I'm bad. <laughs> I'm a sailor. No, and I I was like, oh, I want to make fried chicken. And I had Crisco and all that, and I made fried chicken, and I just did not really season my flour, and my chicken literally tasted like fried flour. Ew. It yeah, was really bad. Good. No, it was like, it was awful. It was like a waste of chicken. You get what I'm saying? I don't know. But I mean, it was my first attempt. Like, I cooked it in culinary school, but. Okay, this needs salt. I love salt. Damn, my my chef salt. used to tell me that I used to over salt things. So, some people but do. I don't understand. Because some people salt is just love everything. Salt. I can. The, I know why people started wars over fucking salt. It's so good. So good. It's like necessary. Because it really oomphs up your dishes. I feel like your I dishes and your bitches. Literally eat this out of the can. Oh my god, I feel like you're gonna literally I feel like you're never gonna go back to these jalapeno poppers without jelly. Ah! Can I have a bite? You wanna try it? Yeah, I wanna try the meat. Okay. It has to be blow on it. It'll burn your tongue, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> Mom out it. Okay, you want to try this? Try it. Imagine on a jalapeno with the bacon, with some salt. It's fucking delicious, but it's it, I I when I eat it, I'm like I'm sitting in a coffee shop eating a bagel, drinking coffee. I'm eating a laptop, like not eating a fucking jalapeno popper. It's good. It's delicious. I'm stoked, dude. 
Imagine like I think wrapped. you're about to change the world. Whew. I used to put a, a apple slice like right here. We'll try that next time. Oh my god, yes. Right. I feel like I'm going to Here. <laughs> That's not me. No, it's all vegan. Tell the world. Holy fucking shit, guys! It tastes so good. Ow. Real tea. So tell me. I almost made pork burgers today, and that bitch. Do you, th I, this is what I'm saying. I don't understand why we're all not vegan. I, I don't get it. It's so it's actually delicious. Really fucking good. I, I'm like ready for these tater tots to happen. I don't eat a lot, but bitch, I'm about to. <laughs> I, this is why I eat so damn much. Oh, what is this? Bene uh, benevolent. Words are hard. Benevolent. So guys, I'm using benevolent. Whatever it's called. This is what the packaging looks like. Sweet Earth Benevolent Bacon. Mm -hmm. It's hickory and sage smoked vegan bacon. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> It's made out of... And uh, we're putting in the air fryer. Oh, yeah. We're going to put it in the air fryer. Mm -hmm. I love my air And the air fryer is right here. So I'm going to place them down over here. Um, okay. And yeah. Okay, okay. And then while everything's cooking, we're going to do the whisper challenge. I have... Wait, wait, wait. Mira. Is, I have... What does Mira mean? Look. In Spanish. Okay. I have. I'm trying. <laughs> we're making Mexican food. I'm from Florida. <laughs> I crazy. have um, more bacon, so if you want to wrap them entirely, you can. Oh, no. No, you're fine? Okay. It's fine. Mira. Mira? Mi Mirame. Look at me. Mirame. People always call me. What's, what's little girl in. Chiquita? No, it's. Mija? Miha. Miha means my daughter because Ija means. Oh, everybody I work with at my job, I am pretty much. I always say Miha too in my work. I don't. I I've been I've been casually saying gracias. Oh my god, stop it! Is that bad? Say it like a normal human being. Gracias. Grassy ass. <laughs> oh, you didn't rub it. Gracias. Gracias. All over the gracias. Morgan, stop. I'm You're not. No. Gracias. Say it normal. Gracias. Say it normal or I'll cut you. Gra Gracias. <laughs> oh my god. My first language was German. Even the most whitest people can say gracias. 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 Gracias, mija. I don't I don't have that like R rolling tongue. You can't roll your R? No. Like uh, at all. Arriba! <laughs> I was born in Texas, what do you expect? Okay. Well, everybody at work when I'm like, oh gracias. Stop saying it like that, Morgan. That's how I fucking say it! And they're like, oh, you're welcome. Gracias. Stop. <laughs> Gracias. Gracias. This footage is going to be about three hours long. <laughs> I wonder how much of it I'm actually going to Gracias. Stop. You're fucking gracia. I saw like that guy who had like clear eyes. Dry eyes. Oh yeah. Dry eyes. <laughs> you have dry eyes. Clear up a clear eyes. Are you going to have enough room for all of them? I think so. Yeah. Do I? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh my god, this is so much fun. I'm living. I, I'm having so much fun that I'm forgetting about my margarita. Oh, that's saying something. I love YouTube. Should I start a channel? Yes. I have never made taco casserole, so we're just gonna kind of wing it. So I got this salsa. This, do you like spicy? Yeah, love. Okay, good. This is um, hot salsa. This is Sprouts brand. We really love sprouts. Spicy? Nah. We're just gonna put a little bit in the bottom, just to kind of coat the bottom of the pan. Okay. Do you wanna use your famous? Oh no, I'll just use this. Okay. No. I live for this thing. I've been wanting to use this fucking spoon <laughs> since I've met her. 
I even did her Now's dishes when I came home today, and I was she like, did. I'm using this. That was so nice. Um, she's like, ew, I'm doing your dishes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. okay, so a little bit of salsa in the bottom. Oh, and there Jesus. goes my phone. Great. Okay, so that's fine. I'll get it later. For the chips, y'all, we are going to be using, okay, this is what, these are Dorito knockoffs. I swear to God, but they're so good. A couple of their vegan. Really yes. Yeah. <laughs> this is um, Deep River Honcho's uh, chips and the ranch flavor. These are vegan <clears throat> and they are the most similar thing to Doritos I've ever had. And they're so good. So we're no, gonna I actually hate sure Doritos. These. Do you really? Mm -hmm. Do you want but I hate everything else. So. But mixed with this, I think it is. Oh, it's probably really good. And then she's using Benito's, which is a vegan flavor. Really long segments. It like. They're vegan. Yeah, I always, I mean, I triple double check my ingredients all the time, but then I get paranoid thinking like since they've been in the pantry that somebody went in and like put something else in them oh my God. <laughs> like i have to double check Bad. i have to triple double check my thing is is like why do you buy a bag this freaking big and you get this many yeah chips? well they have to put all the air in there so the chips don't break and chips are so expensive that's the real tea is why they're so expensive while she's going to the restroom we're going to do this um so these are the um deep river and we're also going to be using the ben field bean field um, Beanfield nacho chips. These are also vegan. And then let me open this up real quick. And so we're just gonna crunch them up onto the layer of salsa that we put down. I'm gonna just grab a small handful, crunch, lay down. Great. Okay. And a small handful here, crunch, lay down. So now, y'all, we're gonna put down a layer of the meat and veggie mix me mixture. Mixture. Oh, so freaking good. I know, dude. It really is. This is one of my favorite things. So whenever you make your taco <clears throat> mix, y'all, always put uh, veggie chorizo in there. You can't go wrong. Honestly. So you know how my boyfriend uh, talks so much shit about being a vegan. I told him I was gonna bring him home a uh, jalapeno popper. Mm-hmm. And I was like, I'm gonna prove you wrong. Yeah. You will. Mm -hmm. So she's oh. going to put a layer of Daya cheese very generously down. Which I've laid right here, sleeping over, mm -hmm. and ate like a whole bag mm -hmm. by myself. <laughs> yeah, do you remember that? Yeah. No, yeah, I do. <laughs> you were like, this is good. <laughs> yeah. Thank God she likes it. Okay. Well, I don't know if it's okay, because perfect. I turned 25, but I used to love cheese and dairy. And now that I'm 25, like as a woman, I don't know what it is, but... Dairy does not go well with my body anymore. Uh oh. But this, when I ate handfuls of it, nothing ever happened. Yeah. Ever. Yeah. Like, it doesn't I just, your I just get so sick. Like, I just, you know. So I'm not breaking up the chips anymore because these are actually pretty broken up <clears throat> already. So I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna continue on with the Ooh, what are you cycle. Spicy? I'm gonna put a little bit of salsa down again. Very spicy. Oh, you want to try them? So those are the nacho flavor. They're made out of beans instead of, um... Oh, thank God it's not cheese. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you like them? Oh, so but no, you have to try these. These are the ranch flavored ones. I'm I already had those. They're so oh, good. you did? Okay. I like those better. Love them. But Dorito, I actually don't really... I don't eat a lot, but... I think real Doritos, I would choose the red bag over the blue. Because I feel like the blue is way too salty. I've actually never tried these before, those. They're pretty good. I, I literally could eat that. Like, it was like a I know, dude. Chili. I, I know. We put some more um, day cheese, please? Yeah. Which one do you want? Are they the same? Oh. No. So we'll just put the rest of that on there. And then I'm we'll so excited. I'll show you the rest. You have no idea how hungry I am. <laughs> I'm like I getting know, hungry. <laughs> Yeah, all of it. Okay. For sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then queso goes on last. Okay. Or... So now we're going to spread the queso over the top. You guys, y'all you, have seen this in my videos before. We're going to be using the Honest Stand. Let me get this in focus real quick. This is what it looks like. The Honest Stand Mild Nacho Dip. And we're going to pour this over, you guys. <laughs> Keep <Kiki's laughs> using. Over You're here just... bothering. Oh, here. Bag Here, do you want to try it first? She here, will. try it. I, I have one. No, this. Oh. 
Okay. This is vegan queso. It's my favorite mm -hmm. uh, version. Holy shit! I know. <laughs> I know. It literally tastes like queso. I know. Kiki. Okay, go away. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, She's I like, like begging. <laughs> okay, so if you'll put Shit, that's okay, so, good. so queso. Okay, put the queso all over the top, kind of like spread it around as evenly as possible. Shit, that's good. I know. One, where the hell was I when you were making this queso? Scrape, scrape, scrape. I am. Oh, you know in culinary, you know in culinary school, uh, your spatula is called your best friend. Why? So every time you're in culinary school, you're like, where's my best friend? And it's your spatula. Because it's your best friend, because no chef wants to leave this behind. So you yeah. scrape every little inch off. Yeah. Did you know that? Thing. No, I didn't. Yeah, it's called your best friend. So I'm going to grab a handful of tater tots. You'll do the same. And then we'll line them up. Should we put them facing up like this or sideways? Sideways, for okay. sure. I've been telling, I've been saying, this is like a make a wish dream of mine. Really? It really is. Like, especially, with, I've been watching her for like a year before I met you. You really? A whole year? Yeah. Wow. I've watched like every freaking video. Aw, thanks. That's really nice. And then I reached out to her and boom, bitch, look where we are. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I've watched you for so long. I can't believe that's so weird to me. Like, it's, it's, I don't oh, know, every time strange. you upload a video, I'm like, oh, I gotta go. <laughs> okay, bye. Like, how when that's how we feel about you know who. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you guys, there's a YouTuber out there that don't oh. just we no we can't talk. We're about not it. getting involved. Oh, we're like three short. Oh, we were missing three times. Just yawn, 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 yawn. No, I want to. No, I, I don't. I don't. It's I don't, fine. Okay. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, you guys, check this out. We've been eating all freaking day. We'll just space these out. We'll space them like two. So I'm like, okay. Madison, you're such a mom. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And uh, now we're going to do the whisper challenge? Yes, we are. <laughs> okay. Look. Wait, I'm going to wait till it focuses. Check this out, y'all. Tell me that does not look amazing. <laughs> Good job. Oh. We're gonna put the jalapeno poppers in the uh, air fryer. We're gonna put this in the oven at like 350 for maybe 20 minutes. Um, and then we're gonna broil the top to really get the tater tots crispy. Yeah. So we'll, we'll be back later. We're gonna have one more margarita and do the whisper challenge. So we'll be back in one second during intermission while the food is cooking. You know what I'm saying? How does it feel to be a redhead? <laughs> Slow down. How does it feel to be a redhead? How does it feel to fuck it? <laughs> no. How does it feel? How does it feel to be a redhead? To be vegan? No. How does it feel to be a redhead? How does it How does it feel? How does it feel to be a redhead? How does it feel to be vegan? <laughs> <laughs> Am I getting the first part right? Yes. Okay. How does it feel to be a redhead? How does it feel to be an airhead? <laughs> Stop recording. Okay. Okay. If I was vegan. If I was vegan. I would eat chicken. If I was vegan, I'd <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> Same, I would too. <laughs> That's what you're saying to me, Morgan. If I wasn't vegan, I would eat chicken. If I wasn't vegan, I'd eat chicken. Eat shit. <laughs> That's what you're saying. If I wasn't vegan, I would eat chicken. Chicken. <laughs> if I wasn't vegan, I'd eat chicken. 
<laughs> my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Wait, what? <laughs> my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. My my bitch. My my bitch screaming at me. My bitch. My milk my bitch. My milkshake. My bitch shake. It my, my milkshake. My bitch. Milkshake. Milkshake. My milkshake brings my bitch boys. eats. <laughs> my milkshake brings all the boys to my the bitch bar. eats some moist. What is it? <laughs> my milkshake. My, my bitch eats moist bread. Is that what it is? Milk bitch. Milk shake. Say it Milk shake. But my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Prosciutto. Mm -hmm. She got it. What were you? She got saying? it. Prosciutto. I did. Yeah, you got it. No, you're lying. I ate your mom's elephant. Ooh. Okay, go again. I ate your mom's elephant. One more time. I ate your mom's elephant. I can't help sell myself. No. I. You can't hear, bitch. I can't. Oh, no way, pause. Okay, go. I ate your mom's elephant. I can't help hump cellophane. <laughs> That's exactly what you said. I ate your mom's elephant. I can't help but hump cellophane. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> Weird. I ate your mom's elephant. I hate your mom out of faith. <laughs> I ate your mom's elephant. I hate your mom's cellophane. <laughs> You're saying cellophane. Say no, the last I'm not. part. No, I ate your mom's elephant. Elephant. Cellophane. <laughs> I ate your mom's, mom's cellophane. <laughs> That's what she's saying. Hey, you guys. So the food is ready. Oh my goodness. Look at this, y'all. I mean, seriously, look at this. Does that not look amazing? <laughs> Are you excited? I'm so excited. Earlier, I put the jalapeno poppers over here on my side, and she's like, oh no, ma'am. They need to go over <laughs> here on my side. <laughs> So we are gonna go ahead and get started. This is the vegan sour cream that I want you to try. So okay. try it out. This is the tofuti sour cream. I think it needs a little bit of salt, but we're just gonna eat it right out of the container. It's really good. Yeah, it does need salt. Mm -hmm. but, but it's really good. Yeah, it is really good. So now that you guys have seen what it looks like here, these are the way the jalapeno poppers turned out. Let's show them. Yummy. I want you to try I want to try the grape one. Can I try that yeah, one? Yeah, here. Okay, grape oh, jelly. Oh, hot. Ow. Okay, should we wait a minute? We can wait a minute. Let's dress our, our, our dish. What do you like on your um, sour cream? You, and do you like everything? Lettuce. Yeah. Okay. Well, here, you dress your side and then I'll eat from this can side. Can I put it right here? Oh, do you want a separate bowl? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me just get you a separate plate. Oh, perfect. You know what? That's perfect. These are hot as... Okay, you can just put a little right here. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut her a little piece. I've been eating these on black olives. <laughs> Look at this. Actually, hold on. I'm good. Hold on, hold on. There you go. Jesus. Look at that. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> but okay. I love this. And then I'm just gonna eat mine right out of the pan. It's piping hot. It's so hot. Okay. Do you have a fork? Oh wait, where's my wooden spoon? Your spoon. I need to use her famous wooden spoon. Here, use use my fork. Oh, the wooden fork. You wanna use that? I'm fine. 
All right, you guys, so let's get started. She's got her little bit on her plate right here. I'm eating right out of the pan because that's how olives. I roll. We've got lettuce, black olives, tomatoes, cilantro. You want some cilantro? I'm good. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you liked cilantro. I love. Okay. So. Actually, I hate that people who like like cilantro but don't use the stems. Oh, really? I, 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 I. Oh, I love call it. myself lazy for not taking the stems off. Okay. Oh, no. Fuck the people who don't use the fucking stems because there's more flavor in the stems. There is a lot of flavor. You're right, you're right. Like, especially with people who don't use the stems in parsley. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. You take it from her, she's the off. chef, y'all. There's more flavor in the stem than it is the... The leaf? Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna try the jalapeno popper with the grape jelly. Okay, are you ready? Mm. How's it? It's good, right? Dude. What the? I told you. Ugh. Oh my god. Imagine an apple, like Dude. an apple spice. You're right, that whole um, spicy sweet experience is happening. Oh my god, put grape jelly in your jalapeno poppers. Jesus, Louise. You like it? I love you it. You really like it? I hope you like it. I oh, really I love hope it. you like it. But I hope you like the, the jalapeno poppers with the vegan cream cheese and vegan bacon. Hot. hot. It's hot. <laughs> Dude. Whoa. I told you. It's so good, Morgan. <gasps> Look at this. Um. Mm. Oh my god. Do you know? Mmm. Do you know? Mmm. Dude, tell me it's not amazing. I know. 